Today's wine text is Roger Sabone, Les Solave, Chateauneuf de Pop, 2016. So a little quick rundown about the winery. Uh, this is a fifth generation winery, family owned uh, in the Cote de Rhone, but they also make Chateauneuf de Pop as well. Uh, this is their original cuvee that they started with years and years ago, uh, and they kept with called Les Olive, which is actually 80% Grenache, 10% Syrah, and 10% Mouvedre. Uh, 2016 is the most important part that you need to know about this wine. Uh, it may be the best vintage in, in my career in Chateauneuf de Pop and, and careers beyond. Uh, Joseph Sherwinski of uh, Robert Parker's Wine Advocate said that this is the 1982 of Bordeaux in the Rhone Valley, which if anybody knows in the wine collecting world, uh, the 1982 Bordeaux vintage is possibly the most collectible vintage um, in 40, 50 years. Uh, 2016 had a perfect season, dry, hot, with some different levels of rain that came through just to uh, replenish and, and keep the uh, grapes growing and the vines growing as well. Uh, this is a full-bodied wine. Uh, it's going to be tannic, big, perfectly ripe fruits on the on the aromas, a long savory finish from the amount of time it spends in oak uh, after the fermentation. And the maceration is, is a month long as well, which gives it a lot of that tannin, that mouthfeel, and that structure. Uh, so the oak is about 12 months, which gives a lot of that vanilla savoriness and that long extended finish. Uh, and this is also a very collectible wine. Uh, 2016 Chateau de the Pops are filling people's cellars right now, knowing that they want to lay this down and, and drink them in the future and not necessarily right away. Uh, but this specific cuvee, I think you can get away with opening now. I think you have to decant it, get some air rolling into it. I would say a half hour, 45 minutes before drinking. Uh, you could definitely enjoy it with things like full body red wines. But these wines are going to get way better over time. Five years from now, ten years from now is where I think these wines are going to really drink really well. So don't be afraid to buy some extras and lay it down and experience them later. Uh, so yeah, Roger Savone, one of the really cool winemakers that we've worked with for a long time. And at an insane price. Uh, that you will not find, you know, rated Chateau de Pop, especially the ratings that this has, uh, under, you know, the price that we're going to sell it for.